So you were the design manager and the, you doubled up as a project controls manager for probably what I'd say is one of the most successful projects in the recent past in New Zealand. And how was that? Was that real challenging for you? How did you fulfill both roles? Well, I actually sure. prefer, and I always have, being involved in a project where you basically roll from the early commencement of a job right through to the completion and handover. Yeah. Like you retain the information, you retain the understanding and all the decisions that are made. So, yeah. in fact, being involved in the early commencement of that project understanding what the drivers of the project were and then being able to help deliver that in a project control space actually made the project controls roll a lot, a lot easier. Not from. the fact that you had a good planner? Oh, yeah, absolutely, that too. <laughs> yeah, that too. <laughs> but that's part of management, right? Yeah, Choosing, getting a team that knows what they're doing and understanding yeah. what their, their resourcing is, how they can fulfill the roles that you need to deliver yeah. the project and making sure they're, d they're doing the, the right focus and like I said very early on I think we had that discussion with yeah. the planning team and, and some of the wider team the quality team as well that this change this focus we're not just a reporting function we're actually here to facilitate change and, and yeah. effective delivery of the project.